Hey, what's up, guys? Petman here, Carolina Varsity, taking a look at a game in the South Mech 8 Conference. Uh, first week of conference play, we're taking a look at the Harding Rams traveling over to South Mech, taking on the South Mech Sabres. Uh, keys for victory in this game for Harding. They're coming off a 19-16 loss to East Mech, where they obviously have progressed and they're, start, they're playing better. They had two weeks to get ready for South Mech. Uh, I think they got to get pressure on the quarterback for South Mech, Antonio Wallace, to force turnovers in the passing game. Uh, Wallace has played really well. Um, but the thing about it is, you know, Harding is going to have to create turnovers in order to, you know, have a chance here. I don't think they can just line up and um, try to outscore South Mech. Um, their offense is a type where they want to control the ball, um, control the clock and be efficient offensively. Uh, they're not a, a huge, big play offense. So, you know, they got to force turnovers somehow, and I think in the passing game is the best way to do it against South Mech. And they can't let uh, Chance Kennedy get into space. Um, you know, he, he's a, a dynamite kick returner, and they throw a lot of screens to him, and he can create things. And, um, you know, that, that's, that's just not what you want because once he gets in space, it can be lights out real quick. Uh, for South Mech, they got to control the dual threat capability of the Harding quarterback, Eugene Alexander. Uh, he can make plays in space. He had a nice, um, he actually had a couple nice runs against West Charlotte that I saw personally. And um, I think he's one of the best game breakers Harding has. And you let him get into space, he can take it a distance real quick. Um, I think you, you do attack the Harding secondary in air. The South Mech offensive line is going to have to step up and protect well. And they give Wallace time. He's shown already throughout the season he can make plays throughout through the air. And, you know, I, I think that's where you can attack Harding. West Charlotte has success attacking Harding in the air. And, you know, Harding, I think they really attack well on the run. They come up. Um, sometimes they can be hurt by play action with their aggressiveness. But, um, you know, don't be surprised if this game is close early on. Harding will be fired up. It's a new season for them. You know, they think they can um, make a playoff run. A lot of people aren't expecting them to do that. But they do have talent, and, you know, once talent meets motivation, uh, it can be a dangerous thing. So, South Mech, you can't sleep on these guys. They're ready to go. Uh, for South Mech, there's been talk on the forums that they've played a soft schedule. They struggled against the one test they had against Myers Park. Um, so, I think you got two teams eager to make a statement. And uh, they're going to come out ready to go, fired up. And uh, don't be surprised if this game was close early on. Um if you look at it on paper, you expect South Mech to walk away with it, uh, hands down. But uh, expect Harding to fight. Expect it to be, you know, a, a closer game than, than you would think. So, uh, you guys have a good game. Hope everyone stays healthy. And um, it's the first step on the road to uh, the playoffs. So, uh, thanks for watching.